11 Easy Minimalist Habits That Are Life-Changing Today I'm going to share 11 easy minimalist habits that are life-changing. 1. Enjoy open space. The goal of minimalism is to only own what you really need. But realizing how little you need can be daunting, and it's easily noticeable by how empty your home gets. However, learning to enjoy the open space can help you become more conscious of what you really need in your life, making it easier to save money and avoid unnecessary purchases. 2. Use what you have first. If you already have a set of dining room plates, then do you really need to get the cute set that's on sale at your favorite store? It can be tempting to buy nice things that you see at the store, but using what you have first will not only bring the highest value out of the item you own, but also curb any impulsive spending you might make. 3. Collect memories instead of things. When trying to save money, it's easy to forget what you're saving for. Most of the time, it's to have a more enjoyable life when you share moments with friends and family. Ironically, by practicing minimalism, you don't have to wait until you get rich to enjoy time with your family. For example, instead of going out and spending it on entertainment, you can enjoy free activities with your friends and family. 4. Repurpose items when you can. All items served at least one purpose, but in most cases, those items can be repurposed for something else. For example, if you're an avid gardener, you can use egg cartons to start your seedlings. You can save a lot of money, the environment, and time by repurposing items when you can. Plus, you end up keeping your home clutter-free. 5. Make mindful purchases. How often do you think before you make a purchase? We're sure there are cases for most of you that you put thought into buying something like a car or a home. But what makes a day-to-day -day item any less worthy of thought? Putting the same effort and thoughts into all your purchases, you'll find that you'll buy much less. And everything you buy will fit well in your home and will be very high quality. 6. Be confident in being minimalist. It's inevitable that you'll hit some brick walls when practicing minimalism. But unfortunately, those brick walls are usually people who try to discourage your minimalist habits. While the opinions of your friends and family matter, it's important to be confident in your minimalism. Not only will this set your habits in stone, meaning you'll have no problem practicing them, but it'll make you feel better about your choices, thus making minimalism something that can be long-lasting in your life. 7. When you're done with something, get rid of it. There are times when a perfectly good item may no longer serve you. Instead of holding on to it, in the hopes that it'll give you use again in the future, it's best to get rid of it. Since the items are usually still functional, instead of throwing it away, you can sell it through an online marketplace like Craigslist. Items typically sell quickly, especially if they're still useful, meaning you'll be decluttering and making money for it. If you want to learn more unique ways to make money, then subscribe to Investors Weekly. 8. Keep counters clean. It's so easy to get a counter full of things you don't need, but it's also just as easy to keep them totally empty. The best way to keep your counters clean is to always put away items you don't need. If you feel it's a hassle to, let's say, put away a toaster, then it may be good to invest in some shelving units to have easy access to it while making your home more organized. 9. Get comfortable saying no. This is a word you'll be saying a lot as a minimalist. If you've seen any videos of people practicing minimalism, you'll see how empty their homes are. Now, if you turn to your regular day, you're faced with tons of ads and stores that push consumerism. And every time you walk by a store or ad and don't buy what they offer, even if you want to, that's you saying no. Fortunately, by mastering the art of using the word no, you'll be much happier with what you already have and save money in the process. 10. Pack light when you travel. Whether you're traveling to the grocery store or to a different country, packing lightly is a great minimalist habit that will help you avoid chaos and even overspending. For instance, instead of bringing a purse with a bunch of credit cards, debit cards, sunglasses, or used tissues, you can stick to bringing a small wallet with only the cash you need for shopping. This will make it easy to stay on top of budget and buy only what you need. Before I share the last, most rewarding tip with you, let us know in the comments below what is your favorite minimalist habit you recommend. 11. Meal Plan You've heard the saying a little planning goes a long way, and it should be no surprise that this is just the case with food. As a start, meal planning will help you practice minimalism. By only buying food that you'll need for the week, it'll help you free up time for cooking and cleaning, and it'll help curb costs by using up everything you have. What's not to love about meal planning? 